Welcome back, my fellow viewers, and uh, this is going to be another review. Now, by the title, you already saw what I'm already be reviewing, but yes, um, yeah, so today's review will be on a very rare plush. I don't know if my disc is on or my Yeti's rare. You tell me in the comments if you're open. But, um, oh, don't, I, I never turn off my comments, it's YouTube turning off the comments. But, um, yeah, here's a super rare plush. The Yeti Zombie. Now, here's a little, uh, story of the Yeti Zombie. Now, the Yeti Zombie is, uh, a, like, a special character in the game. You see him in level, the rain level. Uh, fog. Uh, level 4-10. I have not seen the Yeti. Um, I don't know if it's just the one. Like, I don't know if it's... I'm going... I'm, I'm beating Survival Level 2, so I'll, t I'll record if I see him. But, yeah. This guy's seen 4-10 and is a very rare character. I know there's been, uh, other Yeti sightings if you haven't seen him in it. Like, uh, Plush King 101 seeing them in the, uh, the column game. Now that's just for PvZ1. After this guy's arm gets hit off, um, he will run away. But there's also the Treasure Yeti. The Treasure Yeti is a character in Garden Warfare. He is um, a character that has a backpack and he runs around. I think he has a backpack. And he run I'll show a photo if I find it. But then he, and he runs around dropping coins. It's called the Treasure Yeti. Now there's also one in PvZ Heroes where he's a boss. Oh yeah, there's also a boss Yeti where it's just the Yeti but in Garden Warfare. And yeah, that's basically it. This boss is very, uh, the, this character is very hard to see in the games. Now here's a backstory on this plush. Um, I'm pretty sure the brand is called Treehouse Brands, but um, I'm nowhere near sure. This plush. First of all, it's huge. Like my hand, I have a pretty big hand. I have a hand bigger than my grandpa. But, um, fingers bigger than my grandpa. But then, um, yeah, it's huge. Look, uh, oh, I just a uh, hand around me that's handy. Uh, let's get a better angle. Now oh, here's Eugene compared to him. Look at how small his head is compared to the other Eugene. It's amazing. But going into more detail about this plush, he is um, super rare. I have no idea if my disco zombie or uh, this plush is rare, but tell me in the comments. I think maybe the disco zombie, or maybe this, cause I really don't know. There's one a while back that went for $10,000. Now you may be saying, why are there listings on eBay? Well, I'll show a couple photos or a video of me scrolling, but um, these guys are like $400. They're like 400. And this one is like the hole in the eye for 200. It's it's a scam. Um, luckily I got one and uh, that wasn't $400. But um, yes, this plush, the mouth can come out like that but then I push it back in um and this plush is really nice um okay I have a few problems with this plush before I get into my problems since if you're wondering these nostrils are blue there's a good thing they're completely blue but yeah um another thing the eyes are a hard eyes but they're wrapped in this material um, I'm pretty sure it's like the material, polyester or something. Now the mouth is like felt and the teeth are felt. Um, but here's the problem. It's probably just with mine. The bottom teeth stick, um, they're supposed to stick in. Um, I know there's one on eBay for $275 and the mouth, uh, teeth don't stick in, but I'm not going to pay that much for this plush. And another good thing about mine, uh, there's a few that aren't soft, but mine's super soft. Um, I know there's other problems with this plush, like uh, 
The feet always go like this without problem. Doesn't bother me personally. And uh, here's the thing that I love. I love the luscious beard. Oh, the beard is great. No, uh, here's a weird thing. This guy's no neck. It's like head, then body. This guy's a hunchback. Um, he's a large head and pretty cool. Also, the mouse is this like maroon color. Instead of having a black mouth like him, it's maroon. Now, uh, another thing I like, I like how they added fingers, because some never plushes don't have fingers. And, uh, legs, feet, um, but the thing I love about this guy is look at how soft he is. He's like the most softest thing ever. I love all the fur. Now there's another variation of this plush. This thing, what is that? It's like, oh, I hate this plush. Um, I got it because there's another variation of the Yeti. Just look at how ugly this thing is. It deserves to, oh, die. It honestly looks like a bootleg. It's probably not PUZ wiki. Uh, not everything has to be right. Um, no one cares about your fandom pages. Don't say that seriously. say I actually really like reading the pages. Now another thing. This guy's fur is blue for some reason. It's like has a tint of blue. I don't know if that's wrong. But here's one. Oh, this one's a lot more red. This guy's a tint of blue. The tag got cut off, sadly. But I don't really care about the tag, to be honest. Now, that's basically it for this plush. It's really big. I really like it. And, yeah. Also, um, why we stopped uploading? School is starting, and uh, I don't. Uh, at the beginning of school is starting, and we're probably gonna upload only on weekends now. We'll upload when we can, but yeah. My brother basically quit. Um, I don't know why, so I'm probably gonna be one of the only ones. Him, he might be in videos, but yeah, that's really it. Oh, and here's some similar face types I've seen. Now, Eugene has a face type like his. Like, can't you see it? It's basically just this face, but felt on the eyes and sharp teeth. Uh, and a little bigger. And that, there's also the Europe zombie one. Has a similar face. And the Jazz Wear zombie. Okay, now my overall rating for this plush. He is really good. I like the hunchback and I, if you can find this guy for like under $150, it's just my range, not yours, I would just get it. If it's in good condition, under $150, I would say, no, under $100, I'll just say buy it. Just, it's the best deal you ever get for one of these now. I would say just buy it. Overall, how do I rate this plush? Um, I'd say 10 out of 10. Like the disco zombie. Oh, how could I forget? Size comparisons. Okay, so here's the Yeti with imposter Yeti. Oh, here's the Yeti with Eugene. And here's the Yeti with Shy Guy. Bro, this plush is good. I recommend getting him if you can. Um, so, uh, see you in the next video. Bye. If you want to see more, more uh, reviews, just comment that below or on another video. Because I'm mad. Goodbye, everyone that watches this video. Ooh. Balls, what was the Yeti's voice like? Oh, don't comment on me. I was just trying to comment Luigi fan. Oh.